Abdul Rahman. I'm a lecturer at a public university in Kenya. I deliver lectures in computing and informatics. In our last lesson, we discussed about control structure selection, whereby we discuss uh, three types of selection, the if, if-else statement, and the switch statement. Today, we are going to ask ourselves, what is a selection, the if block? And on to that particular note, <coughs> we are actually going to define what it is, the uh, if block selection. So the if block selection, basically, <coughs> what we are saying is a condition. So it, if, we are saying if a condition, if a condition is true, then what happens if a condition it is true then a statement is executed however if the condition is false then the program ends so basically, we want to conspecialize that into a diagram. So if a program starts, and then if it is given up a condition, if this particular condition is true, then what happens? then we have block of statements or statements are executed. However, if it is false, then the program ends. So, So this is the logic behind uh, the if statement. Uh, so what is the syntax of it? So basically, the syntax is you are writing up the word if, and then into two brackets, you are putting up a condition. This particular condition it can be any type of condition. It can be relational condition or the logical condition. So if the condition it is true, then execute some statements and then end. If it is false, then end. So this basically will be the syntax of it. So let's see how we can implement the same. So we are going to take up two numbers. Let's say int a is equal to 10 and b is equal to 30. So we are saying if a is less than b, you are using up relational uh, conditions, then do what? Then print true a is less than b and then end. So basically this is how we are going to implement it. So let's go to uh, c uh, uh, Dev C++ to try and implement the same. So here basically we are saying int a equals to 10, b equals to 30. So we are initializing and actually giving up a value. So we are putting up our if syntax. If a is less than b, what happens? We are saying if a is less than b, uh, then we are saying print f print f what do we want to print uh, basically we are saying true a is less than b true a is less than b 
and we terminate. So if we run this particular program and our condition it is true, then we are going to see the words true. A is less than B. So let's execute and see what happens. So when we execute this particular program, basically, yes, we are seeing the output says true. A is less than B. So for now, this is the end of an if block uh, statement in a selection uh, category. And in our last lesson, we are going to take up uh, the if else statement block and see how we can define, have a syntax and implement it. Thank you for now. However, don't forget to subscribe in our future videos. Thank you.